time for a change. What do you think? Gotta stick with Dave. Dave's pretty awesome anyway, but... Why don't we ditch Emma for a bit? Grab Albert. Trade Weber for a uh, for Deemer. Been a while since we seen Deemer. Let's do that. Let's take Deemer. Albert Deemer, Dave. It's a pretty good list. Spirit. This Deemer is one of those guys who are probably just mass stack spirit. The only other thing that was what was interesting on him was. Strangely enough, attack. But also, SK speed could honestly be pretty good for that, too. I think we'll just keep him on spirit duty for now. Agility's great for Albert. Get even more evasion going. And we definitely need to re-equip them. Alrighty, what we got? Crap! What about here? Oh, that's not bad. Because you might run into a gladiator. Hmm. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, sweet. That's nice. Okay, Dave seems fun. Let's see what kind of staff we need. Run and stick. Mm. Bernard's a magic stick. Oh, wow. Look at that attack jump to 72. For a mere five spirit points. I'm gonna give that a try. Let's take a peek at Deemer. He's, he's rocking 72 attack which is comparable to both Albert and Inebria. These guys don't hit very hard to begin with, but... Oh. We definitely don't have a sledgehammer in the party, but... We got a bunch of utility. Another interesting stuff. So... Exactly. No, uh, no brownie points spent on attack and hit 72. That's pretty nice. There's a cave right there. I think I'll go check that one out. Wait, who are you? I keep cutting my toes on rusty scrap metal! And I feel a little feverish. In fact, I think I may have hallucinated that a guy walked into that shack over there last night. If I was to take these hammers, this man would starve to death. That is a fact. Hey, partner. I reckon you're looking for a little smelting to be done. I specialize in chocolate and black rocks here. Only $75 per chocolate bar. $100 per black rock bar. Smelt me. Great. Will it be chocolate rocks or black rocks now? Give me, the, give me the chocolate. You're the boss. And here we are. All finished, Mr. Mister. Sweet chocolate bars. Oh, oops. Alrighty. Two 
black rock bars. Sweet. Finally, the creator of this game made a line of dialogue for this barrel. And this is all it says. Whoa, just have one of those moments again. <laughs> Not bad, not bad. But not great either. We've gone over this. Not interested in swords. Oversized cocktail weenie skewers. Sideways chests don't have the same impact as side boob, unfortunately. This is just inconvenient. Cocktail weenie skewers, man. Is it a dick point? It's not a dick point. That'd be really... That'd be not fun. That'd be not a nice thing to do. Just dig on someone else's place. It's got a nice shop here. Guess I'll just dig in it. Speaking of digging... God damn it! The shovel cracked! And for nothing. As a general rule, I don't reach my hands into anything with spiderwebs, unless the reward outweighs the risk. Hey, you. you. Um, hi? Welcome to the docks, hombre. Need a boat? Yes, actually. It's gonna be 7,000 for the smaller vessels, 12,000 for the larger, per day. Oh crap, are you serious? Of course I'm serious. But if you want, I'll give you a special bargain for one week, 25,000 for the smaller craft, 50,000 for the larger. What's stopping me from taking the one-day fee and staying out forever? Uh... Hmm... I, uh... I don't really know, to be honest. In that case, I'll take the smaller vessel for one day. Okay. Wait, right now? D maybe later. I still want to check around. Come to me, my delicious morsel. Mmm, frosted pineapple cake. Must be the abandoned place. I sense a great disturbance in this crate, as though hundreds of voices have cried out and were silenced. Just a bunch of useless junk, really. Must have been a really boring dude who lived here. Or lives here. There's a dead seagull in here. Yes, Tickles! Yes, Tickles. <laughs> uh. It is 10.30. That's right, should be open for Two to four. Ooh. Sorry if I sound a little hoarse. I've done some previous VA work today. Hmm. Let's take a peek at stuff real quick. <laughs> What's that I see descending from the lower stratus? Oh, it's Alburn. Falcon drop kick, celestial ejaculate. Slow roast. That's gonna be a big one. Just gonna kick it and wait for until 2 o'clock. Ah. Oh. Should 
take too long. Got a lot of bars in here. Looks like one more chocolate and one more black rock will give me uh, one more of each. Wow, 14 lady sandals, 16 knightsies, 32 pansy lines, 14 carnivations. Really need to take those to a uh, to a potion dealer. Hmm. I don't remember being this high, this high leveled. I think I was talking with uh, Steve about this at one point. It's a real makes a real difference when you fight a lot of stuff and never run away from fights. That was actually the hardest part about the desert. I never wanted to run away from everything. So I would find ninjas that would, like, deplete my time. And in the end, I passed out, like, six times, and that's when I started getting frustrated with the desert. <clears throat> hey, what do you know? Do you have the note? Uh, yeah, it's here in my pockets. Produce it at once! Okay, okay, calm your horses! Excellent. You have it. Then yours is the hand chosen by the master. Oh, is this one of those cold things? Because I don't do those. Quiet. Listen. Yeah, I'm not really hearing anything, to tell you the truth. The master beckons. The time is now, disciple. We must gather the lost pieces of a great and powerful technology from a civilization buried under the sands millions of years ago. We will forge an artifact known to those ancient gods as the iPod. This task has fallen into your capable hands. Look, man, I found this crumpled up note in a hole in the inn's wall. You probably have these things stashed all over town. Speak no more of this nonsense. The master has chosen it is you who must journey to the corners of the earth in search for the iPod. Find the pieces, build it, bring it to me, and together we shall be kings! Who the hell is the master? And why should I share my kingliness with you if I'm the one finding everything? My hours are from 2 to 4 a.m. every day. Be gone! Have you found and constructed the iPod yet? No, I'll... Uh, I'll let you know how that turns out. Great, we're gonna build an iPod. <laughs> it's time to build an iPod. I used to have a lot of money. Then I came here, the poor country, and somehow lost all my money. I don't know what an iPod is. <laughs> Alright. There is one person I have completely disregarded thus far. Because I was so certain that he was the one that, uh, that progressed plot. Let's go give him a nice chat. Gross toenails, girl. Hey. I don't remember this. Aw, oh, man. This is Black Rock, isn't it? Ah, I could have had another bar. Step away from the door, brother man. You better trust me on this one. Sworn he was the one that progressed stuff. Oh well. Let's see. He wanted like twenty-five thousand dollars, didn't he? <laughs> That's a lot of money. Is there anywhere in town that I missed? Go see if he will be more than willing to uh, pot with a boat. Kept thinking there was something more over there. Mm 
bum bum. Big guy. Yeah, man. Let's do this. By the way, sir, just follow this dock all the way to the end and you'll find your brand new small vessel. Wait! Hold on! What? Hey, mister! What's going on? You gotta help us, man! This town just ain't right! <laughs> Look, man, to just leave or something, like I'm doing. See what I'm doing here? I'm about to get on this sweet boat. You don't understand. It's almost time for the lottery drawings. If you don't do something, these people will be stuck here forever. What the? Lottery drawings? What the hell's so bad about that? That sounds like something that is awesome. Whoever's chosen for the lottery gets fed to the darkness. It's the only thing that keeps it from swallowing this whole city. I'm getting on my boat now. No, wait! You can't leave us like this! Someone's going to die if you don't help! What exactly do you want me to do? I'm just a normal guy. Are you kidding me? I can see the veins bulging through your armor! You are a certified grade A monster slayer! Sorry, pal. Not me. I'm just your average Joe. Best of luck with your darkness problem, but I'm on my own quest right now. So that's it. You're not gonna help us. You're not even going to try. Thanks a lot, pal. Really, thanks. You might have been the only person to pass through this town capable of helping. Just go on ahead. Worry about yourself. Don't look at me like that. You know as well as I do that we don't have time to go prancing through the darkness. Oh no, I totally agree with you. You do? Yeah. In fact, the sooner we get going, the better. Seriously. I'm 100% serious. God damn it, we have to go back. <laughs> you got it, boss. <laughs> One thing before we do that. It may seem petty, but Deemer wasn't at full. I never like to walk around without full. Away from the brother door, brother man. You better trust me on this one. Oh, there you are. That's the one. You again? What's the matter? Forgot to spit on me before you hopped on your fancy boat? Not quite. I heard you had a darkness quandary. I'm here to shed a little light on it. What? You're gonna help? I mean, I'm, I'm assuming that's what you said, but your your pun was basically incomprehensible. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna help. No promises this is gonna work, but I'll at least give it my best shot. Oh, thank God! This has been going on every st on ever since this place was an active mining colony. They dug too greedily, 
and uncovered deep, dark beings. Sounds like a book I didn't read once. Yeah, well, this isn't a fiction novel. This is very real, and very serious. Through the door over there is a hallway that leads deeper into the mines. At the end, you'll find it. The Deep Crow. Time to go show this crow the meaning of deep. You know, cramming my foot up its ass. Deeply. Tell the man at the door that Gabriel sent you. He'll let you in. Bless you, travelers, and may you be successful for the sake of us all. Will do. Sorry for being an asshole about this earlier. I'm just going through a lot. Forget about it. What's important is that you're here now, and willing to help us out. Anyway, what made you change your mind? My old people beating friend said he agreed with my decision. That's as good a sign as any. Step away from the door, brother man. You better trust me on this one. Gabriel told us to tell you that, uh, we're gonna go kill the Deep Crow. What? Are, are you serious? Pretty much. Dear God, you must be out your head. The Deep Crow is immortal. Well, I think he's a bitch. So we're gonna kill it. Here, take the key. The door can be opened from the inside, so I'll close it behind you. Good luck, man. You're insane. Maybe I am a little insane. Insane in the membrane. Oh. Insane in the brain. Yeah, that's right. Insane in the membrane. Yeah, insane. Got no brain. See, why don't we sing anymore? Honestly, I, I kind of feel like we have a little groove going whenever we, you know, we get together. You know, just you and me, Palmer. Together. I still look gay now. I, I'm kind of done with this. Holy crap, why did I spend so much money over there? I'm basically poor again. I'm going to be eating rocks with these folks pretty soon. Gabriel, you need to move. Oh hey, look at that. The creepiness just got amplified. Big time. What the hell? What is this thing? Blood. Nah. Memories. What have I gotten us into now? All right. Let's take stock here. We are walking into the lair of the Deep Crow. We have no super hard hitter. So, I'm not gonna say that this is. This ain't gonna be difficult as heck. <laughs> I think this is gonna be difficult as heck. Yeah! I like it. I could switch someone in. I kinda feel like a challenge at the moment though. Hey. That's the ticket. <coughs> and when I say I really want a challenge, um, I'm not really boasting. It's... I really love this section of the game because, uh, my very first encounter with Deep Crow before the crow got nerfed, I walked out of this lair or rather, I walked away from the boss fight, and Ebria was dead, Emma was dead, Dave was dead, and Palmer had one life. He had just gotten back up from the last full throttle I had, and uh, and I got one turn before the crow did, and I managed to get his ass. 
It just is beautiful. Oh man. I'm feeling it. Oh. Well, that just killed the mood. <coughs> Lava Rats, hey guys, man. Oh, burn. Wait, burn. Oh, crap. I don't have any band aids. Oh, man. I'm so sorry. I'm oh, wait. No. Oh, ho, ho. Wait. Burn. I'm sorry, I'm thinking of bleed. My apologies. I'm thinking of bleed, not burn. No, that was my problem in the desert. The ninjas kept hitting me with bleed attacks, and I never didn't have any band-aids, so I was bleeding a lot. Oh, boy. Warm beer. Gotta stay fresh. Four points of health, I will heal it. <sighs> Slap some ice on that sick burn. <laughs> Alright, Deemer, is there anything that C6 points can help you with in this next fight? I could increase your speed. Your agility's not great. In fact, you're the slowest party member here. I think I'm just going to save it. Here, while I check my gear, listen to some good music. This doesn't get you pumped. Check yourself. terrifying thing I've ever seen in my life. What the hell am I doing here? Hello. Deep Crow. Well, I guess he's never so we'll just be on a frig! And there it is. The Crow. Look, look at all those eyes. What does he need all those eyes for? Alright. I think the most important thing is to establish which status effects I can hit it with. I don't know if that really works too much. Let's start a slow roast. Didn't do anything. All about confusing story. I just healed inebriate. Why did that happen? Poison. Silence on Deemer, great. Never mind. It's a good thing we have sound shrooms. A plenty. Shadow boxing. Oh god, okay. Deemer's turn's almost up. Go. Fire blast. Yes, apparently there is a boss that is multiple deep crows in this game called the Deep Murder. 
Oof. Falcon drop. Blindness. Great. Submerged? Oh jeez, it just got crazy dark in here. I can't see a damn thing. Save your energy, y'all. Don't just go swing around in the dark. hang out until he calms down. Yeah, pointy hail did seem to do the most damage. seem to be getting any lighter in here. There we go. Back to killing. Damn it. Alright, worry about yourself, Dave. At least it was an Ebrit. Uh, more health. What was the oh, fermented beer? If that's the one. Yeah. Share the goods. Keeps murdering him. Oh, 
Hey, there it is. Nothing to him. <laughs> Sweet bone javelin and feather cap. You're leaving, and I'm never helping anyone with anything ever again, ever. Don't mind if I fucking do. <laughs> now eat him and gain his power. Is there something back there? There's probably nothing back there. Deemer, please don't die on me. Annoying bringing you back. Whew. It's a big crack in the wall, but it's too dark to see anything. How many times you do it? I'm never going back in there. Ever. You can't tell me not to fire blast a flame rat. You're not my dad. Jeez. <laughs> Damn it, inebriate. You would critical when I don't really need you to. Um, I don't think it's uh, different if I looked at the crack before taking him on. The insidious. <laughs> Go get it, fellas! sound like an ass, but I do kind of miss the old Deep Crow a little bit. Hey, what's up? Whoa, you're back! And you have skin! What happened down there, man? I've seen things. What? You came back from the lair of the Deep Crow! You've done it! Yeah, I've done it. Your Deep Crow problem is no more. Oh god, thank you! Thank you so much! You have no idea what this means to me, and to all of us! Now that the beast is dead, we'll never have to sacrifice- Yeah, I should hope not. As for ever helping you again, you can forget it. I'd rather poop a whale. Listen, mister, I can't pay you, or give you anything of value since I have nothing to give. But I can promise you this, the people of Lewiston won't ever forget you as long as I live. Alright, it's time for me to head out. With any luck, I'll never have to come to this weird-ass place again. So long, Gabriel. So long, Slayer of the Deep Crow. Oh, we got some sweet gear from that, too. Still not as good as Emma's homemade deliciousness. However, this does blind. Which is kind of cool. But I'm going to stick with the stats. Let's see. Ooh. Protects against darkness. Yeah, Dave will take it. Dave's just gonna wear everything from the mini bosses. That's didn't really call it a mini boss, it really was a boss. Right! I have Albert in the party for a reason. There are reasons why he is here. Definitely not because I uh because he's mute. That's one less line to read. <laughs> Is this the guy? 
Jeez, oh, this guy's not alive. He's dead, in fact. Oh, I thought that was a Albert one. Alright, we'll, we'll walk around and chat with people. What's this I hear? You've slain the beast which lives in darkness? How can this be? I don't know. I just sort of stabbed him a bunch of times. Remarkable. We're all free now! We're free! <laughs> I can stop standing here warning people about entering Lewis and... <laughs> This girl gives me some seriously spooky vibes. This dirt looks like it's been dug up before, but I'm not just diving in there without the proper equipment. Oh shoot, I broke all my shovels. Oh man, I'm down to two mining picks too. the darkness that took my husband was finally purged. I hope it was a painful experience for whatever creatures lived within. Hey man, you got these books out there? Yeah, yeah, I got your books. I got your books right here. I don't think that made any sense. It did. Hi there. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's right, I read, I read your stuff. Aw, oh, jeez. It seems like it would be cool, but it's not! Oh, floppy headgear is good for him. Blown out slippers, judicial robe... Um, hmm. Floppy headgear, baby. So floppy. Alright. The hundred eyes of darkness have been blinded! A hero arises from the depths, a beacon of hope for the people of our dismal tribe! Buy something, man. Please stick on my kids. Metal galoshes. <laughs> Dang. That's actually decent for Albert. Hey, I missed Mac! Hey man, you like dinosaurs? Of course I do. Who doesn't? Yes! I knew you were legit, dude, the minute I saw you! Go on, what's your favorite kind? Oh darn. Let's see. Let's see, I said Tyrannosaurus Rex to the young boy in Litchfield. I wonder if this guy's different. Seriously, who, who whose favorite dinosaur is a Stegosaurus? Never come across anyone that's ever said that. Hmm. <laughs> Someone in chat it does love the stegosaurus. Sorry, man. Are you joking? Aside from being pretty good at baseball, T Rexes are overrated. I thought you'd have known better than that. I meant to say Tarceratops. Now we're talking. It's not often I meet someone with your kind of good sense. Three horns, man. Three horns built for wrecking your day. It's like the Triforce. Except all three of them represent the same thing. Pain. Ah, oh, man, look at me. You got me all excited and talking about Triceratops again. I tell you what, take this. I need to cut back on my axe swinging anyway. Tricera axe. Sweet. It's time to resume my beauty sleep. Um. 
bum bum. Back to the pillar? Which pillar? Pillar. Oh, oops. That's the right pillar. Albert, everything all right? What the? Whoa! How do you know about that? Fallen. A seeding secret little den. Poison times three, jar of female angst times three, claw fingers. Claw fingers. Ooh, just call him Albert Scissor Hands. Mind if I do? Those are cool. It's gonna stack 200 agility soon. Hey, Albert, looks like you left some clothes behind. Thieving cowl. Y'all gonna steal if you ain't got no thieving cow. That's a good point. This is actually not bad. Defense down by two, agility down by two, but he's got agility through the, you know, you know, through the wazoo. Up the wazoo. Around the wazoo. Inside the wazoo and in everything about the wazoo. But it increases evasion, which just one point of evasion, I believe, is pretty strong. Two. My precious child, should you return, I have been chosen this month. Do not fear for me, because I do not fear the darkness. Make me proud, like I know you would have made your father proud. Wow. Dear Mom, I'm leaving. Please don't be sad, because I will be okay. I'm going to go and find the man who killed my father. When I come home, I will bring lots of money for you. Wow. Albert's bedroom. Well, I guess Albert was your real name after all. Can't believe you wrote this. Must be weird being back here. A bunch of old, dusty, and broken things. It's a portrait of Albert's mother, I would guess. Huh. Very cool. Still tempted to talk with like everyone in town. <laughs> Pretty good. Oh, great. The only worst thing worse than a tourist is one with a learning disability. Thought I told you to get out of here. Got nothing else to say about your money, but I'll sell you a point. Ooh, dis killing. <laughs> Can't solve everything with bloodshed. Yeah, we could, but drag it, Missy. Do 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 stay for the night. <laughs> Got some bloodthirsty people in Twitch. <laughs> mm. 
no way, man. I've talked with the quiz master. I totally just chatted him up and everything. He may have pissed me off. Never once did I, like, ram my foot down his ass. Or up it. Alright, let's go ahead and smelt that last Black Rock Down bar. I beat him to death with words. Fine. <laughs> Somebody disagree with me. I'm still. I, I think I kind of dig the Albert Dave, uh, uh, Demer party. Oh man, man, look at this beautiful boat. We are keeping this boat. I'm never, not ever, going to never go anywhere without this boat. I definitely don't ever guarantee that. Yeah, I don't know. I always thought he was just a little lackluster. But, uh... Albert, that is. But I'm gonna try some new stuff out with him. Hang on to him for a little bit. <laughs> Although I will say that with more party members later on, I'm probably gonna be sticking with a very strange party because I've been having some ideas. For anyone that may be saying, where are you going, Hootie? Don't worry, I'm just swimming around, man. It's all good. This is your relaxation break. Dave still be there? Quite possibly. I love Dave. He jives very well with how I play. Which is to say I like to live on the edge and just spam items. No, can't hit the uh, dark blue tiles. Also, if you're playing through your own uh, TDP game, you should probably just check out the forums, too. Uh, the forums were updated in regards to the character abilities very recently. Uh, so they did a great job on getting those all listed out. They've given me some ideas as to what uh, I'd like to build on my party members. Probably not right now. Maybe later. We'll get to that later. Alrighty. Anyone level up? Deemer still rocking that. Oh, Albert. Albert, Albert, Albert. Agility and evasion really are your, really is your bread and butter, so I'm just gonna stick with that.